Time now to check on the weather. Those of you in our area who woke up yesterday morning to another soggy Saturday mm -hmm. may be looking forward to some type of relief today. You're just going to mm -hmm. have to layer up. Right? Yeah, I mean, well, yeah. at least at least one layer. Yeah. It's right. a little chilly out there. It is. That's the difference. But we thank that cool, dry air for making the sky look just like this. This terrific shot looking south through Manhattan right now down towards uh, Lady Liberty in the harbor there cloudless it is just fantastic this morning but it is 51 so it is going to remain brisk for the next several hours until we probably get up to around 60 for a high this afternoon our wind is westerly at 16 miles per hour so that adds to the chill this morning checking around the five boroughs and across the river into nearby new jersey we've got all readings within a few of 50 from the bronx down to staten island Brooklyn, Queens, and over the river, over towards uh, Newark here. Temperatures are all near 50. Let's widen out that view. Temperatures are all still near 50, but it is, you know, I mean, mostly north and west of the city. We've got a couple of 40s out here, especially north and west of 287 and on up into the Hudson Valley. But um, you're not going to see it rise all that much. You know, while it was just an awful day yesterday with anywhere from an inch to two to almost three inches of rain, it stayed between 65 and 70 all afternoon. Now the air mass has completely changed. The storm's up here. So the winds are clockwise like that around uh, the storm. Uh, they uh, continue clockwise around the storm. On this side of it, that means northwesterly winds. And so we are going to see that northwest or westerly wind bring in chillier weather right through the day today. It's the coolest air mass yet of the season. And then 5 to 10 degrees below normal. Think about it. We were 5 to 10 above normal all last week. So this is definitely a taste of November. We just can't seem to get ourselves right in the middle and get it right with October, which means a normal high for this time of year, about 67, 68 degrees. We're either above it, below it. Today we're going to be below it, tomorrow too. And this is accompanied by these wind gusts of 20 to 30 miles per hour or so. So right on through the day today, and then they start to diminish a little bit tonight. Radar all clear. You didn't even see a cloud, so there's no way to make any precip over us right now. But there are some changes. Take a look back to the uh, far left side of your screen there, and you do see some showers that are coming in across the Great Lakes. They'll most likely weaken once they hit the mountains of the Poconos and the Catskills, but it is possible that a sprinkle could make its way in here uh, as we go through the next little while, um, let's say into the afternoon hours and into this evening, a sprinkle or two over the hillier terrain. Now, this counterclockwise flow that you see here is going to continue right through tomorrow, and that is likely to bring us another round. Every time a little spoke of energy comes through, another round of a brief shower or sprinkle. That's it, otherwise it's a dry week. So look, uh, look at Futurecast here. A sprinkle, a couple of little showers scattered around as of 5.30. And then we have our uh, just a patchy cloudiness a little bit during the night tonight. Another little brief area of showers could come through Monday night and on into Tuesday morning. It's not heavy. It's not anything that's going to cause any major flood problems, at least not foreseen through this week. 47. That's our low for tonight. Mostly clear sky and chilly. 30s across the northern and western suburbs. Winds west 10 to 15 miles per hour. These are the feels like temperatures. Can you imagine we're suddenly starting to use wind chill? It's not all that impressive, but still, you can see that Sunday night lows are going to be generally in the 40 to 45 degree range and some 30s north and west. Here's the future cast free, uh, uh, feels like temperatures, generally around 40 degrees or so and 30s north and west so if you have work or school on monday you're going to feel the chill 59 for tomorrow afternoon and here's our seven day forecast the counterclockwise winds around that storm system are going to keep it cool through today tomorrow tuesday wednesday thursday and temperatures will basically be in the 60s on there there's one day i left out i'm not going to talk about that right now <laughs> <laughs> it's a lot happen between yeah. now and then. so feeling like fall now definitely yeah. and, and that's what it would uh, that's what it took to get rid of this rainy weather pattern for the time being those cooler temperatures for the okay. time being being the key words right <laughs> thank you craig thank you